Hey guys and girls, in this video we're going to take a look at the best keyboards for programming. I made my research and this list reflects my personal opinion, and I've listed products based on quality, durability, price, and more. I've included options for every type of consumer, so if you're looking for an entry level option or the best product money can buy, we may have the product for you in this list. If you want more information and updated pricing on the products mentioned, be sure to check the links in the description down below. The products mentioned are in no exact order, so be sure to stay to the end so you don't miss anything. Also, if you want a chance to win one of the keyboards for programming in this video, just subscribe, don't forget to hit the notification bell, and leave a comment with a hidden word in this video. We will pick a winner and notify them when we reach 5,000 likes. Okay, so without further ado, this is our pick of the best keyboards for programming on the market right now. Coming in number 10, we've got the Kinesis Freestyle Edge RGB. The best keyboard for coding with an ergonomic design that we've tested is the Kinesis Freestyle Edge RGB. This 10 keyless model has a fully split design that allows you to position each half the way you want it. Also, it comes with a detachable wrist rest for both halves, and you can buy a lift key separately if you want to adjust the incline settings. It has good build quality with stable keys and keycaps that feel nice to touch. It has hotkeys for media control, and you can remap all of its keys, whether directly on the board or using the companion software. There's also 8 dedicated macro keys on the left side. Note. You can't use it wirelessly, and it lacks some features like a USB pass-through or a Windows lock key. That said, it's still one of the best keyboards for programming that we tested. Number 9. Razer Black Widow Lite When we say Razer Black Widow Lite is one of the best programming keyboards that you can get in the budget category, that is for good reason. It comes with an excellent typing quality because most of its keys are stable and light to press and the tactile feedback helps reduce the number of typos. Although it's mainly designed as an entry-level mechanical keyboard for the office, it's great for programming too. The ABS keycaps aren't as good as PBT, but they still feel nice and shouldn't wear out easily. Unfortunately, it doesn't come with a wrist rest, and typing may feel fatigued after some time due to its high profile. But even though it's not ideal for competitive gaming, it's good enough for programming, and you shouldn't notice any delay. Overall, it's one of the best keyboards for programming that we've tested. Coming in number 8, Obens Lab Annie Pro 2. If the Razer Black Widow keyboard doesn't meet your needs, or you prefer a compact model, do consider the Obens Lab Annie Pro 2. While it doesn't have a wrist rest or any incline settings, and its customization software is harder to use than the Razer Black Widow V3 Pros, it's a 60% compact board that takes up less space on a desk. Also, available with a variety of Cherry MX, Gateron, and Kale switches, giving you more options. While it doesn't have a USB receiver, it can pair with four devices at once via Bluetooth. If you want a full-size wireless board with a wrist rest and two incline settings, go with the Razer keyboard. However, if you're looking for a 60% compact model that will take up less space on your desk while programming, then get the Obens Lab. Coming at number 7, Razer Black Widow V3 Pro. One of the best wireless keyboards for programming that we tested is the Razer Black Widow V3 Pro. This full-size board comes to a computer via its USB receiver or Bluetooth, and you can pair it up with three devices at once and swap between them using the switch on the left side. You can customize the RGB lighting and set macros to any key using the Razer Synapse 3 software. Also, there are dedicated media keys and a programmable volume control knob on the top right. Unfortunately, the customization software is available on Windows only, so you can't make customizations on other operating systems like Mac OS. On the bright side, you can save your settings on the onboard memory, and they'll remain when you switch to Mac OS or Linux, but the RGB settings don't stay. All in all, if you're looking for a full-size wireless board for programming, this is an excellent option. 
Number 6. RK Royal Kludge RK61 For those still after a compact keyboard, why not try RK's Royal Kludge keyboard? The 60% keyboard offers a smaller alternative for those with limited space or want to travel with their keyboard. The white keyboard features 62 keys, providing you with all the needs to program with ease. The keyboard doesn't feature the number pad that the larger ones do, offering you more space on your desk for a mouse. Fantastic for gamers and programmers alike. RK's keyboard features a brown switch, offering a faster double tap and a quieter sound when typing compared to a blue switch. So, you're less likely to be scorned for your loud typing with this keyboard. The keyboard also features an RGB backlight design with 18 modes to choose from. Why not customize it to suit your style? What's great about this keyboard is the night mode, perfect for late night programming that won't strain your eyes. It's comfortable to use too, and shouldn't put your hand in any unnatural positions. Whether you're working all day or into the night, you will be comfortable all day long. After a compact keyboard that is sure to make programming easier, grab the RK61 keyboard today. Coming in number 5, Microsoft Sculpt Ergonomic Keyboard Microsoft Sculpt is a computer programming keyboard highly recommended for work ergonomics. It is less complicated than the Kinesis and considerably cheaper. However, they use different methodologies, so it wouldn't be unfair to compare them. Unlike the Kinesis, the coding keyboard splits the keys into two by completely removing a chunk of material between them. However, the motivation behind is still the same, to position your fingers and arms in a more natural position while reducing the amount of strain involved in typing. And it does this excellently. You'll have a much easier time typing on this keyboard compared to the Kinesis, but it still requires some practice before you can adapt. The keyboard responsiveness is quick, and it feels like the perfect integration between a laptop and a desktop. This is definitely one of the best wireless coding keyboards, so you don't have to worry about tangles. Coming in number 4. DAS Keyboard 4 Professional Mechanical Keyboard This keyboard is one of the sturdiest keyboards we have on this list. This is attributed to its aluminum top panel. DAS Mechanical Keyboard for programming has moved from the usual Cherry MX switches we are used to and to Gamma Zulu switches that can last for about 100 million key presses. This is about two times the MX. One of our favorite features on this keyboard is the wrist rest. It is super comfortable and makes typing a little faster. The volume knob and the three dedicated media buttons on the top right are also quite useful in controlling your media on your PC. And what's better, you can now assign all the 12 function keys to other tasks. Nevertheless, I found the volume knob to be a bit bulky and much harder to handle. So why is this keyboard called Smart? It is compatible with the IFTT protocol that allows you to set various keys to alert you when there's some activity online or around you. For instance, you can set it to notify you when there's a new comment on a thread you are following on Stack Overflow. Or a more practical example, you can program it to alert you when your phone is ringing. You might not hear it ring while coding, but you won't miss the blinking keys. Number 3. Kinesis Advantage 2 Keyboard for Programming If you're interested in the most comfortable ergonomic keyboard for programming and coding, the Kinesis Advantage 2 is a standout choice. The split key ergonomic keyboard features a unique design with concave key wells at an optimal angle for supreme comfort when working long hours. It also has high-quality Mechanical Cherry MX brown switches. Its unique split concave key wells and thumb control number and function keys may seem odd at first, but it allows for a less fatiguing and more natural hand position. And with full key remapping, QWERTY and Dvorja support, and on-the-fly macro programming, this is also a great choice if you're looking for the best keyboard for programming Mac and Linux applications. Coming at number 2, Logitech G915 TKL For those with a bigger budget, why not give Logitech's keyboard a whirl? The keyboard is a fantastic option for programmers who work on the go, thanks to its wireless design. The 10 keyless keyboard features 
up to 40 hours of battery life on a single charge. Perfect for those after a wireless workstation or a keyboard they can travel with. There's also a low battery warning light too, so you're never caught out, and a fast charging time of 3 hours so you can be on the go again. Logitech's keyboard features RGB lighting that can be personalized to suit your needs. There are over 16.8 million colors for you to choose from, offering endless possibilities and even custom animations through the Logitech G-Hub software. You can expect fantastic accuracy from the keyboard and extremely responsive keys, perfect for long days spent programming. The mechanical keyboard delivers the clicky sound we all know and love too, making it the ideal choice for work or play. After a wireless keyboard that will save some space on your desk, look no further than the Logitech's offering. Number 1. Corsair K95 RGB Platinum XT The best mechanical keyboard for programming with a wired-only connection that we've tested is the Corsair K95 RGB Platinum XT. It has a high-end gaming keyboard with a ton of features, including 6 MMO keys on the left side giving you extra buttons to which you can set macros improving the user's experience while programming. They offer good tactile feedback and excellent typing quality that feels nice to touch. So typing on it for long programming sessions shouldn't feel tiring because it has good ergonomics and comes with a comfortable wrist rest. It has full RGB backlighting with individual lit keys, but it doesn't display pure white well as there's a hint of red. All in all, if you want the best keyboard for programmers, you should be happy with this one. That brings us to the end of our review and buyer's guide for the best keyboards for programming. Hope to see you in the next video. Let us know in the comments what is your favorite one. And if you like this content, don't forget to subscribe and get notified when we launch new videos. Thanks for watching. Peace.